Burnout is defined as a state of chronic stress that leads to physical and emotional exhaustion, cynicism and detachment, and feelings of ineffectiveness and lack of accomplishment. Burnout zaps your motivation and productivity, and the best way to avoid burnout is to schedule a day of rest each week. Let's look at the sales of some of the world's largest food chains. McDonald's, over $2.6 million per unit. Starbucks, over 900,000. Subway, over 400,000. But Chick-fil-A, over $4 million worth of sales per unit. Chick-fil-A makes more money per unit than McDonald's, Starbucks, and Subway combined. Chick-fil-A sales are incredible, but even more so when you factor in they are completely closed one day a week. The principle of rest has been around for a long time. In the beginning of the Bible, it says that God set one day in seven aside for rest and worship. In the beginning of the book of Genesis, it said, God blessed the seventh day and made it holy. This seventh day, a Sabbath, is a day of rest from your work. After reviewing these incredible sales numbers from Chick-fil-A and reviewing some verses on rest, I started to think maybe we could be more effective and less likely to experience burnout if we took a day to rest each week. But taking a day of rest can be one of the hardest things you could do when you're overwhelmed with responsibilities and you're not progressing on your goals and dreams as fast as you would like. But when we don't take that day of rest each week, we tend to do a lot of mental traveling. Mental traveling as in, when we're at work, our mind is somewhere resting. Because our mind is somewhere else, we aren't fully focused and productive at work. Because we aren't fully focused and productive at work, when we're resting, our mind may be at work, trying to catch up for that lost productivity. However, when you do take that day of rest and know it's coming each week, that's when you can be fully present at work. And when you know that rest is needed to restore your body, mind, and soul, there's no guilt with that rest. Your mind can fully take a break from your work, and during this rest, you don't need to cross anything off your to-do list. Many times over the years, I've experienced burnout, and now I know why. I would take the time each night to rest my body and sleep six to eight hours, but I never took the time out of my week to rest my mind and soul. I never went more than a few months working on a goal without burning out, stepping away for a while, only to come back and burn out again. But then I started scheduling my rest and took this day of rest seriously. Now with my schedule, it's not the same day of rest each week. Some weeks I'll rest on Sunday, other weeks it may be a Tuesday or a Thursday, but roughly one in every seven days, I take a day of rest. Where I don't focus on being productive, I don't focus on hustling and grinding, I just focus on resting. And I rest guilt-free. Ever since adding this day of rest into my schedule, I'm more at peace. Even though I'm resting more than before, I'm more productive than before, sticking to my goals longer than before, and not experiencing burnout. This online headline captured my attention months ago and transformed my thinking when it came to taking a day of rest. If you're stuck in a rut, overwhelmed, and experiencing burnout, consider taking a day of rest. Not just for one day, but intentionally scheduling it one in every seven days. I know it may not make sense to you, especially when you feel you need more time to get everything done. But give yourself a day of rest to restore your mind and soul. Take the time to do something you enjoy. Spend time with your friends and family. And take the time to step away from your work so that when you come back, you'll be restored, recharged, and give yourself a chance to experience the success Chick-fil-A is having. If you do take this advice and start taking a day of rest, let me know in the comments section what effect it has on you. Also, if you're looking for more ways to transform your thinking for the better, consider subscribing to this channel and hitting the bell notification so you don't miss the newest video that releases on Mondays. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.